So what's going on guys, Mr. Dalek JD here, and today I'm going to be bringing you guys an Extinction Awakening video, which is the new Extinction map from the new Invasion map pack, which has come out today for Call of Duty Ghost. And I'm going to show you something which I have not seen anyone show before on YouTube, so this may be an exclusive for the first time for you guys, so I'm really excited to bring you this. And uh, if you do go on to enjoy this, be sure to smash the like button, as uh, Easter eggs are very, very cool, there's something I like to do, and I'm sure you guys are going to appreciate doing this Easter egg. Now within Extinction, I usually have... A Easter egg of sorts and there's been previous ones where you could turn uh, where you could shoot aliens and they turn into golden teddy bears or you could shoot aliens and they turn into snowmen well this one is pretty similar but also has a few added bonuses so in order to do this Easter egg you simply need to get to the second area and the only thing this Easter egg involves is being in the first and second area so Jumping straight into this, as soon as you spawn and come on to the outside, once you've completed a hive and it's like, you know, pretty clear and there's no aliens coming after you, that's the best time to start this easter egg. So what you want to do, is you want to come over to this mushroom pad, and as you start to bounce on it, if you look over in this direction, you'll notice a really bright yellow extinction egg on top of that cliff there, just kind of just chilling there. And what you need to do, is you just need to spray it with a weapon. Now, the way we've worked it out is you can't use weapons that have the arc attachment. For some reason, that doesn't seem to work. At the at the moment, doing this one, I don't have an attachment on my Remington, but later on, I do, and find that it actually doesn't work, so we end up switching to pistols. But you need to keep spraying the eggs until they explode. It may take you quite a while. As you can see in the gameplay, we struggle a little bit because it's really hard to keep on target when you keep bouncing around. You don't exactly bounce straight up or straight forward. You kind of bounce to left and right. You need to kind of control that. But once you do, you'll know you've done it because the actual egg will explode. Now, annoyingly, the actual locations of the eggs can change. What I showed you in the last clip is it was to my right. But if we actually bounce up here, you'll see that the egg is now in the left. So when you actually play, the eggs might actually be uh, in that location rather than the other location but the second location in this area doesn't move from what I know if it does move though then it will be in a location that's very near it so you won't miss it so the location that I found the second egg on is to bounce on the same mushroom pad and look to your left right towards the spawn and when you bounce up you'll see the egg on this cliff face right here and like I mentioned you can't shoot it with weapons with the arc attached onto it so in the end uh, we end up using pistols again for this and uh, it is uh, it is a pretty far distance, but the pistol will manage to get it pretty quickly. And as you can see, the egg definitely does explode there. So now let's move on to the second area. So to get to the second area, you have to complete all the hives within the first area. And that will unlock you access to the second area. So to get to this section, come through uh, up on here. And then you want to be hopping onto the mushroom pad here. And this is where we want to end up. But you can't simply jump up there. So just follow the path that I do. The verticality on this map is a little bit confusing confusing at times but once you get used to it using the mushroom pads it actually turns out quite well so within here you will come across a mammoth which is the new rhino and once you completed that come through and you will see the egg on top of that little crevice there like I mentioned earlier got to shoot it with weapons that don't have the arc on it as you can see it's not affecting it whatsoever hope we switch to our pistols and uh, the egg explodes really really quickly so that's the third location that location may move if it does it will be somewhere very very close to it and now let's move on to the last location now this fourth egg could either be slightly to the left of where the original third egg was located but this is where the other location for it could be and this is one of the little kind of little crevices which has the schematics in and you'll come across a few cryptids including a rhino which is uh not very pleasant but if you have the arc attachment it really really helps in dealing with uh cryptids it kills them a lot more quickly so once we do take care of this rhino and hop back into here you'll see that there'll be an arc for you but behind this little area here you'll actually see a bright extinction egg and that is our fourth and last one so when you do shoot this it produces something very very cool so on our screen we can see this very very weird kind of Egyptian hieroglyphics flying around which is very similar to the uh, uh, field order on the map Pharaoh which gives you all the perks and it's kind of similar to that But instead of giving you all the perks It will give you all the abilities that are in extinction for around about two minutes 50 and there's a time that you can see down below But it gives you stuff like unlimited feral instincts and here's the best part when you shoot aliens It actually turns them into little mushrooms. So very similar to the uh, Original extinction Easter eggs would turn them into bears and snowmen this one turns them into mushrooms Which is very crazy, but it's awesome because you get added abilities as well 
Now, this could be described as a god mode, but you don't have infinite health, so I wouldn't class this as a god mode, but it does give you all the abilities, which is really, really good, and is a lot of fun, and it's very, very quick and simple to do if you guys have a few spare minutes to just bounce on some pads, shoot a few eggs, and then grant yourselves this awesome easter egg. But if you haven't seen this round before, do share this round with your friends, as this is the first time I've seen this easter egg in action on this new map. If you guys enjoyed it, do drop it a like rating, like I mentioned earlier, and Make sure you're subscribing as I'm bringing you guys a whole load of awesome Extinction content throughout the day. There's a playlist link down below which will take you over to all of the videos uploaded today of some incredible Extinction videos and more coming up. So you guys don't want to miss this. But thank you so much for watching and I'll see you guys very, very soon.